Welcome to skill check. Skill check is where we are going to put all our efforts together and execute what we learned in all the previous lessons. So let's change the hat from being a librarian to being a movie enthusiast. And what we are going to do is we are going to use a postman echo, which basically, you know, returns back whatever you send it to replicate a movie API. We are going to use query params. We are going to add authorization. We are going to add body and we are going to do scripting. So let's go ahead and execute skill check request. Now for doing that, let's go to Postman and we need to add that below delete a book request. Make sure the order is important because that's how it will be tested in the final check. So let's go ahead and add a request below delete a book. Name it skill check. Now let's go ahead and read the instructions and execute accordingly. Now, if you go to task number one, it says make a request skill check. We already did that under delete a book. Yes. Now go ahead and add the echo API URL. So let's copy this URL and let's go ahead and add it there. Nice. Now, if you come back here, it says the method should be a post method. So let's go ahead and select post method from the drop down. Let's save this. Awesome. So task one is done successfully. Now let's go and do task two, add a query parameter called as movie name. Now you all know where to add query parameter, right? So let's go here. Let's click on params and here in the key, we need to add movie name. The value is going to be your favorite movie. Now, if you are, you know, watching Hollywood movies or Bollywood movies, you can choose any one from them. Personally, I love inception. So I'm going to choose inception. Save this request, send it. Now, if you send this, you can see that the response we are returned, the response which is returned is nothing but what we are sending. So that's what Postman Echo API actually does. Nice. Task number three, turn your base URL into a variable. So here we need to change the base URL into a variable called as skill check base URL. Now you can see there are two tabs caps letter here. So let's just copy this exactly as it is. We don't want to mess up the name because it will be tested exactly like that. So from M to edge, let's select the URL. Let's add as a new variable, click on set as variable, name it skill check base URL, select the scope as collection level variable and hit set. Make sure that you're saving this request. Nice. Task three also done. Task number four, use API key authorization. The movie theater API requires the request to be authorized. So let's go ahead and add a key of student expert and the value of skill check. But remember, we need to use authorization tab, not on collection level, but on request level. So let's go ahead and do that. So here you can see the authorization tab. Let's click on that. From here, we need to select API key. And then here we need to select the key and the value. So the key, let's go ahead and copy from Academy, which is student dat dash expert. And the value is skill check. Make sure the key and the value is exactly as it is given right here. Save the request and send it. Awesome. Task number four is also done. Last two tasks, task number five, add a JSON body with the property actor name. So we need to add a JSON body. Remember where do we add a JSON body? Exactly. So let's go to postman. Let's click on body from here. Click on raw. You can see by default it is JSON. So we are not going to touch that. Now here we need to add a JSON body. So curly brace is open, double quotes, and here we need to provide the key. The key is actor name. So let's provide that. And the value is going to be our favorite actor. Now, whoever is your favorite actor, you can say like that. For me, I am my favorite actor. So I'm going to choose my name and add that, uh, you know, in the body. Ensure that you're saving this request and then hitting send. Now, if you look closely in the response, we see that the arguments which we sent are written back. The movie name which we sent is written back. The actor name which we sent is also written back. Nice. Over to the very last task, task number six. Here we have to set a variable using post response script. 
So remember the add book request where we set the variable ID. We have to do exactly something similar, right? So we have to go ahead and set a variable called as actor name. Uh, set the variable called as favorite actor with the value of actor name which we passed in the body. Let's go ahead and execute this. Now if you open Postman, you have to go to script and here in the post response, we need to add the script. Now you can go ahead and you can type it, take inspiration from our ad book or you can use Postbot. Don't tell anyone because Postbot is our AI assistant and we are technically taking the AI's help. So let's go ahead and click on this icon right here in the scripting tab and let's hit continue. So what we are going to do is we are going to give Postbot a prompt and then ask it to write the scripting for us. Please don't tell my manager. Okay, so let's go ahead and copy the prompt from here. You can see, you know, we have given the prompt exactly like this. Now, if you are a pro coder, you don't need to kind of do this. You can kind of go ahead and type it yourself, but this is for everyone else who's not a coder. So let's go ahead and execute this. Now, if you run this, the script will go ahead and do that for us. So you can see that it does exactly this for us and it also writes the comments for us. So you can see that it is extracting the actor name and then it is setting as favorite actor. Now we need to save this request and then hit send. And if you go back to the collection name, click on variables tab, you can see the favorite actor variable being created. So that is all the six tasks which we have done successfully. Make sure that your collection looks exactly like this, right? Um, and ensure that your submission variable is set. The next step is to claim our certificate. So yeah, we are done with skill check.